I would like to uh, stay on this picture and uh, ask um, publicly myself and, and also you, uh, was it worth it? Because when I think about $2 million, it's, it's really a huge amount. And of course, we can think of many other needs in education, in healthcare, in, in helping uh, disadvantaged people uh, in many other ways. But was it worth to put so much money in this uh, synagogue in Poland? And the answer is uh, yes. I hope you're not surprised. <laughs> <laughs> We saved, uh, first of all, there's uh, several reasons. Uh, we saved uh, the prime histo historical heritage site. We returned it to the Jewish context. Before it, were, there was, it was a library. Nobody was thinking about this place as a synagogue, as, a, as some historical presence of, of this uh, special minority. Um, we have uh, also created a tool in encouraging uh, Jewish and non-Jewish non tourism, and which is important from, to promote uh, um, the, the, this Jewish material culture as part of national heritage. We created a tool for uh, education and also like implemented, built in uh, educational value into the, this place. Um, we are promoting by restoring the dignity of this place where people prayed for many centuries. Also, we are promo promoting co coexistence and tolerance. We are opening this space to people that they should come. Everybody is welcomed to see what was this uh, um, input that the Jewish people had in Poland as a part of minority and uh, but uh, which contributed tremendously uh, in Polish culture throughout the years. And uh, we also built a platform of communication and cooperation for broader culture. 